Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl, La Gordisitz. And today I'm with my handsome son, Christopher. Hello. So today we were craving some homemade burgers. So La Warden done hooked it up for us. So big shout out to you, Warden. Thank you, Grandma Warden. Yeah, so we're, we got all the fixings, tomato, lettuce. He don't like none of that. And then today he's going to try my childhood favorite hot sauce which is red devil with doritos and sour cream so yeah let's say a prayer and then we'll dig in because we hungry heavenly father we thank you in the name of jesus for a smell which we're about to receive father i thank you for all the blessings you have given me thank you for being a merciful god um, I pray that you bless the people that are going without, Lord, provide a warm meal. Also, I pray over the homeless, the orphans, the widows, and the widowers, Heavenly Father, as well as the elderly people. I ask that you keep them wrapped in your arms, Lord, and please bless Gordi's Nation and everybody else that's watching, Lord. Bless them in abundance. In your heavenly precious name we pray. Amen. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Okay, there's your bread. And you can fix your sandwich however you like. Okay. Can I get some mustard? For my top buns, I like mustard and ketchup. Mm, me too. You too? Let's give it a shakey shake. So how's everybody doing today? Hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. I know we are. Mm -hmm. Enjoying our day. Do you need mustard? Sorry. Yes, please. Stop. Put that over there. Can I have some mayonnaise? Okay. We have been craving some homemade burgers, you guys. Oh, yeah. I ran out of my McCormick Lime Mayo. So I'm using Nana's Light Best Foods, which is my second favorite. No biggie. Okay, ready for your... Yes, please. Thank you. Mm -hmm. mm. No toppings for you? No. No? I like it all. Dang. Look at these nice crispy lettuce. You want to tell what we're drinking, Pa? We're drinking the Mountain Dew Major Melon, my favorite. Zero sugar Major Melon, guys. They are so good. If you haven't tried it, try them. They're really good. I'll be the first one to take the sip. <laughs> Delicious. Is it tobate? You don't like tomatoes? Not really. Not with my burgers. Mm-hmm. Chris is going in already. Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot about onion. I love a ton of onion. Now I could kiss my honey with onion breath. Not me. Oh, I'm kissing you next. Come here, Christopher. <laughs> All right, I got to taste this soda. You say it's really good. I tasted the one with sugar, but let's see. Ooh-wee. That's good. Christopher approved. Wow, that's good. You want pickles with your burger? Yes, yeah. Please. My hands are clean, y'all. There you go. Thank you. Mm. Oh, I hear Grandma salivating over there. Oh. <laughs> For the pickle hubba. Yeah. I'm going to do it half and half. How's the burger, Pa? It Cooked really to good. perfection, thanks to Nani. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mm hmm Mmm. 
Mmm. Oh, yeah. That's bomb. I love homemade burgers. Especially turkey burgers. Mmm. Christopher, are you excited for this month? Me too. Thanksgiving's coming up. I can't wait. This year, you're helping me cook. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You got to learn all the traditional turkey, I mean, Thanksgiving foods that we make. <sighs> and I don't want to hear nobody cubby for me for my background. All my stuff is in stowage because I'm in the process of doing things. So, we got to deal with the Halloween background, all right? So. So good. No, we're not going to Goodwill, Nana. Why? Because I, uh uh. I just took you yesterday. No, you did not. Uh huh. Girl. Mm hmm. Are you excited for the Red Devil? What? Mm -hmm. I heard it's really vinegary. Mm. It's like vinegary is like pickle vinegary. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can put um lemon on it too, not just red devil. We will do red devil, lemon, sour cream. Or if we didn't have lemon, we'd like to use uh, the juice of the spicy cauliflower. Mm-hmm. Christopher's like, eh. Mm. So I'll put them on mine. That way you can taste it first, okay? For those of y'all that like to see step by step. Make sure each chip has at least a droppy. Can you put this sour cream? Yes. Here you go. Was it opened already or no? I don't know. Probably not. <clears throat> Mommy, do you need any sour cream? No, I'm not. No? I'm a little nervous. Why? Don't be nervous. You're gonna love it. I'm gonna buy some Oh, we should have. We didn't think. I'm time. sorry, Ma. I gotta go back for more water, anyways. Yeah. Okay, I put the sour cream right there. You want sour cream on your plate? Oh, I have a little bowl right here. Oh, oh, thank you. Right. 
There you go. Ready? One, two, three, go. Honest, honest opinion reaction. <laughs> you like it? Would you get it again? No. Yeah, he said, yeah, ma. Ooh. I told you in awe oh, for many years. Christopher, try the red devil. Christopher, try the red devil. Hmm. Take me back to childhood. I haven't had chips in a minute. excited for what's coming up. What? Thanksgiving? A little box from somewhere. Oh, for dessert. Mm -hmm. I feel like today's very chill. Yeah. I love the weekends. Mm hmm. Just for both off the lemon juice. Excuse me. You okay, Mom? Yeah, I'm okay. Mm. My leg. Your leg is hurting? A little bit behind. Oh. But under. Talk about the crazy weather we had yesterday I, and today, huh? I know. We went from, what, like 80s? Come on. Really cold from the 80s, guys, to like uh, to the lower 50s with with uh, overnight. <clears throat> yeah, it was that's dead. <laughs> mm -hmm. These kids are cray cray, man. They don't like to wear sweaters. <laughs> I'm just built like that. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you, but back in my day, everybody used to wear hoodies all year long, even in the summer. People still wear hoodies in the summer. Black ones, too. So you guys are the odd ones out? We like to enjoy the whole weather, huh, Pa? Mmm, <clears throat> finger looking good. can't remember the last time I had Doritos. You, Ma? A long time, huh? Oh, a long time. It's been a while. Mm -hmm. I don't need them anymore. Mm -mm. I'll eat one or two. Mm-hmm. I don't do opposite days. I do opposite years. <laughs> what does that mean? So I wear um, I wear hoodies in the summer, uh -huh. and I wear uh, short stuff in the winter. <laughs> wow. That's funny.
Whoopsies. You made the meat just how I like it, Ma. Really, yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm
It does taste like ham. Mmm. We all are keeping them. Mmm. That's pretty good. You didn't taste one? Yeah. I ate one. But you don't like ham. Is that a big one? Oh. Yeah. I am. Next one is called Pasatiempo oh, by okay. Nestle. Yep, this one. And these are extremely extremely popular cookies in Brazil that consist of cookie stuffed with milk chocolate filling. Ooh. Especially designed to provide a nutrition filled and fun snack time made with a mix of oats, cereals, whole milk, and chocolate flavored drops. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay, I like the packaging. It's really cute. God, I really, really enjoy these treat boxes, and so does my family. It's so cool to randomly see which one we get, like which country we get. And it's crazy because the ham chips sound weird. Uh huh, but, but they really taste good. really good, yeah. If I could open this, sorry, technical difficulties. Oh, oh, it had a red tab. Where mm -hmm. it, it says Puxe mm -hmm. P U X E to tear the paper, and I was struggling. <laughs> Lord, okay. Ooh, looks good. Cookie and cookie. Oh, it smells really good. Okay. Oh, I got a picture of an elephant and a little monkey. How cute. I got, um, I got a picture of a little tiger. I got a meerkat, I think, and a giraffe. Oh, that's cool. A giraffe with shades. I got a monkey and a giraffe. Mm. I mean, a uh, zebra. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, they're good. They're not extremely sweet. Mmm. Okay, the next one is called Churrasco by Torcida. Brazilians are known to be big football fans, and these chips are a great football snack. Oh. Torcida, which means cheer party, is a reference to friends gathering to watch the football matches. And it says, a sabor churrasco. It looks like a type of meat. I'm assuming beef. Yeah, probably beef. It looks like a steak. Okay. Oh, they smell funny. Oh no. Go ahead, guys. This is what they look like. Try one. Mom, you know to say, don't mind if you try it. Oh, they smell weird. You're not gonna like it. I didn't like it. Oh well, I'm gonna try it either way. It's just like, okay, it's not that I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I didn't like it. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> oh, but the appetite is good. I had to do a replay. <laughs> That's my cue for now. Oh. <laughs> I just, I just. Well, stop like, making me laugh. Mom, I need water. I just, here, take a bite of my watermelon. <laughs> taste out. I was like, no, I don't want to say it. I don't like it, but. So yeah, I don't know if it's because we're not used to having meat flavored chips, but that was not the best. Mom, I want like this. I'd say that's our least favorite. Yeah, I want like this. Uh-huh, you were real quick, huh? Yep. Yeah. All right. Mm. Baton by Garroto. As it was on my tongue, like, <clears> the <throat> flavor. Yeah, I was like, like, oh, snap. I'm like, maybe there's a little filling inside, which makes it better. I yeah, no. Mom. Okay, this is the baton. This one is a delicious chocolate stick in the cylindrical form of a baton. Baton is the best-selling chocolate for children in Brazil, 
And in 2012, it was consumed by more than 17 million Brazilians. Wow. Wow. So. That means it's a popular. Yeah. Let's check it out. Oh, it's just like a stick. Want me to bring grandma this one? Mm-hmm. Okay. So just pure chocolate, too? Huh? Pure chocolate. Mm. Take a little bite and pass it to your brother. Yeah. It's pretty good chocolate. Though. Okay. Here you go, bud. It's not bad. I just say like a holiday candy you buy from the store. Yeah. Yeah. You want to pass it over there? Mhm. Mm it tastes like those little candies in the wrapper with uh, either like a snowman or reindeer or something. Mm, yeah. 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 Okay, the next one is Laca. Wait. Laca Branco by La. <laughs> I'm assuming it's this one. It has a white. It's by. It's a rich and creamy chocolate bar. The taste of creamy and smooth chocolate is perfect for satisfying a sweet tooth at any time of the day. Hmm? I'm assuming it's white chocolate. It's sheet. Yep, it's white chocolate. Oh, my favorite. I love white chocolate. Two. Oh, I just heard the first one. Mm-hmm. Good old white chocolate. Yep. Yeah. Okay. What I like about the treats box as well is... They give you a variety mm -hmm. of stuff. It's not like one or two or three. We tried how many already? Six different stuff that we wouldn't be able to try, you know? Wow. I like that. Unless we were to pay money and travel. Yeah, travel and get them, huh? Them but then again, also... it'd be more expensive. Oh, I know off the bat, I'm not going to like this because I am not a big fan of coconut. Oh, baby. Mm. Tell them that also they can purchase if they liked only one candy they can purchase a certain amount of them oh yeah that's true i mean if you like one or the other you can research and just to buy like a whole box of those i don't want to buy the ham ones yeah mm, i don't know I don't i'm like still so iffy ham. about the meat flavored chips that's weird i want to buy it uh it was it's one not of, weird it's but it was one of the ones from the last one yeah but it was from a different country i know Mm -hmm. I'm buy one. So this one is Prestigio Blanco. It's chocolate bars filled with coconut. The chocolate is creamy and the coconut filling isn't too sweet. Together, they come together to form a delicious and unique flavor of chocolate and coconut blended together. Ooh. It sounds this good. one's made by Nestle. That's so cool. Yes, that one too? Dang. Yeah. Okay, I see you, Nestle. It must be good. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, it smells like coconut right off the bat. Have fun. <clears throat> well, I guess I'll take a bite first. Mm -hmm. That is really good. Yeah? Does it taste a lot like coconut? Mm-mm. It mainly tastes the chocolate. Mm -hmm. the Too after, much like cocoa? No? The well, aftertaste is coconut. Mm -hmm. It just tastes like the bread from... Coconut bread, yeah. Mm-hmm. With chocolate. Wow, okay. So it's not strong. That is not bad. You know, and I don't like coconut. Yeah. That's good. That's bomb. All right, next one is Choquito by Nestle as well. This one's a chocolate bar filled with a chewy fudge center and crunchy rice crisp covered in real milk chocolate. How can you say no? Say yes to the good stuff. Choquito only says yes to the good stuff. Chokito. So, a shokito. So it has the rice crisp. I know I like that. That's like um, like a crunch, crunch bar. Yeah, but thicker. Snap crumble. Thicker than a snicker. Mm. <laughs> Pretty good. Is it full of rice? No. Well, it's so good. Or just the outside. Mm -hmm. Just like an outside the arch. Okay. Pretty cool. Yeah. Next one is Loyo by Nestle. 
And this one is the cutest chocolate. Delicious chocolate bonfire filled with malted milk, a favorite in Brazil, and a delight for all sweet lovers of all ages. Mm. Has a little picture of a yellow cow. So this one's also a bar. Mm. I don't know what malted milk is, but it has like the consistency of um maybe like whipped cream type. Like a whipped chocolate. Not too whipped though, because yeah, it's, it's like it looks fluffy. <clears throat> it, fluffy. it looks fluffy, but it's it's not extremely. Okay, next one, Diamante Negro by Lata. Dark chocolate bars are made up of rich chocolate with crunchy honey inside. The combination of the creamy and smooth chocolate with crunchy honey gives it a texture anyone would love. Simply different in a good way. So, it's dark chocolate, but with crunchy hot, uh, honey. Mm. I'm not a big fan of dark chocolate, but we'll try. I'm okay with dark chocolate. You're if he like sometimes it, sometimes and sometimes not yeah because sometimes that dark chocolate is like really strong so. yeah no breaking half just take a bite oh. i'll just take a little piece here. oh i see the honey in there oh, oh there's little shards of honey in there okay i see what they mean crispy mm -hmm. or crunchy so the, the honey pops it whatever all, you don't like throw it away <clears throat> i'll keep it all right. This was some milk. It's not bad. It would go good. Well, that was the end of it. Aww. That was so much fun. Yeah. Oh, and they give you a little. Mm. Oh, they have a mystery box giveaway. Wow. That is so cool. All right, well, thank you guys so much for sticking around until the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed that treat box as well. That was very fun and a good experience to try different treats from a different country. If you guys are interested, I'll drop the link in the description box below. Please don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment down below. And um, I appreciate each and every one of you. Until next time, bye. Bye, everyone.